Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today's problem is going to be about population genetics and here is a problem in population equilibrium there are 1000 people, there are 160 recessive homozygous, 480 heterozygous genotypes, calculate the frequency of the dominant allele. So as you see in this uh, population we have two alleles, one dominant, one recessive, so let it be uh, capital A and small a. So these two alleles would make this uh, gene pool of three genotypes that these two alleles can make. The first genotype would be homozygous dominant, second genotype would be heterozygous, and third genotype would be homozygous recessive. Uh, we are told that we have 160 individuals who belongs to the homozygous recessive genotype, 480 those who belong to the heterozygous genotype, and we are not told how many people belong to this genotype, but this is very easy to find, so 480 plus 160 would be 640 and total number of the people is 1000 so 1000 minus uh, 640 and uh, the number of people who belong to the homozygous dominant genotype would be 360 so this is number of individuals now we have to find number of alleles. For example, 360 people here each has two dominant alleles. So we have to multiply 360 by 2. And uh, this is how we would find number of the dominant alleles. So this is going to be 720. And here we have 480 individuals. Each also would have two alleles, one dominant, one recessive. So total number of alleles here would be 960. And here we would have 160 individuals and each individual would have two recessive alleles. So that means total number of recessive alleles here is uh, 300. Now uh, we need one more step. Uh, we now uh, quantity of the dominant alleles, quantity of recessive alleles, but also uh, dominant and recessive alleles present in heterozygotes and uh, that means that half of this number would be dominant allele A and half of this number would be recessive allele A. Or in other words, uh, we can say that 960 consists of uh, 480 dominant alleles A and uh, 480 recessive alleles A. And here is the number of the dominant alleles. So we have to basically add this number to this and this to this so we would find um, quantity of dominant and recessive alleles so um, 720 plus 480 would give us um, 1200 of the dominant alleles A and here we have uh, 800 uh, recessive alleles A. So now we have to find the frequency of the dominant allele. One step left. So total number of alleles would be 1200 plus 800. Or we can add uh, these numbers. So total number of alleles that 1,000 people have 
would be 2000. So this is very easy and number of the dominant alleles is 1200. So we have to divide 1200 by 2000 and the answer would be 0 0.6. This can be an answer, but if you need an answer uh, in a percentage form, we have to multiply 0 0.6 by 100, and the answer would be 60%. And this is going to be our answer today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. Please write your comments, questions if you have any, and see you in the next video. Goodbye.